Hello and welcome in to another Harry Potter meme speedrun on this channel. And today we'll be doing the long-awaited sequel of the Touch Grass Octafactor run I've uploaded on my channel a while ago, the Stay Hydrated% percent Octafactor speedrun. And back then the promise was to touch grass as quick as we could in all of the 8 PC Harry Potter games, and it's basically the same today. We're gonna touch water in all 8 PC games as fast as we can. There's one exception to this, we do not count rain, both 2 and 5 have rain at the very beginning in the intro and we thought it would be a bit easy and also, I mean, can you get hydrated from rain? I don't really know. But apart from that, any body of water that we can touch counts and gets us to the next game. So how long does it take to touch water in all 8 Harry Potter PC games? Hope you're gonna have some fun finding out in this video and watching this. Thank you so much, enjoy. It is a meme octafactor. We're gonna have to stay hydrated. Oh, it's water, by the way, of course. It's brown water. Um, let's start the intro. It's, there's nothing about the starry sky, apart from a lot of hydration, I think. No oh, I forgot about rain, actually. I guess that's fair. Rain not counting is fair. I did not have that in my route. Uh, but I'll talk about that a bit in a second. I planned it a bit ahead with Sonya's help as well. We brainstormed a bit how we get... Uh, how we get to step into water. I don't want to take a lot ahead though, I think we just talk about game by game. So I'll talk about HP1 and then we, we get to HP2, I talk about the, wa uh, the water I want to touch there and so on and so on. HP2 will be done before it starts. Yeah, it's pretty quick. I think a lot of them are really quick. HP3 has glaciers. True, actually. We wouldn't have to we won't have to play that far. That's the only thing I'm saying. We're getting wet this run, yes. Yep, yeah, rain doesn't count, apparently. Dennis just as the person requesting it just decided on it, which is totally fair. Again, wasn't in my route, but it's you know, fair enough. This run should actually be very fun. I mean, I'm not saying that Chungus run yesterday wasn't very fun. It was, but that one was definitely more painful than this one's gonna be. Oh, you did actually put in the rules I have to drink water every time I touch it. Fuck, I only have coke, is that okay? <laughs> Do I have to get a second glass? <laughs> yeah, HP2 would end before it starts exactly, so we wouldn't... We wouldn't actually do that. Yeah, I, I didn't think about that, the water in, in the willow, but we don't we don't count rain. I think that's okay. Also, I did do the touch grass octo as well, after Rene, though. I think he was the first to do it, but I don't think anyone's had done this, the uh, stay hydrated touch water octafactor. Uh, to get out of your way for getting Harry wet? Yes, 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 yes. I, I will try to go as fast as possible, basically. Um, so I will just just reach it as quick as possible if it's in the normal gameplay or not. If I have to get out of it, then yeah. Uh, HP5 has something. We thought of something. I won't leak it. We only talk about the game when we get to it, I think, just to make it a bit more exciting and let people guess how long is the run. Honestly, I think it's probably like two to three hours. Is a don't touch grass run possible? That's a cool idea. Ah, uh, leak it. Oh my god, yeah. Actually, five fat. Five fat uh, pun. Touch fire would be interesting too, yeah. I don't know about don't touch grass. I would have to think about that in a bit more depth in a second when uh, chat is a bit less fast because I have issues following it up. Carpetless, also interesting. Like, see, you can you can request those, technically. I'm down for all of the requests. Also, I, the rules should be set, but I think Stream Elements is being spammed a bit right now, P, so <laughs> try it again now, it should be fine. I will probably forget to drink water when I touch it, yes. I You know, my, you know me too well. One to four should be easy. Wait, four is easy? I know five. Five, I we, I found a good way with Sonya, like with Sonya's help. But I'm actually not sure about four. I was actually ready to play until the second task. But I guess we'll see. Maybe we find water somewhere else. Uh, oh, there's Aquairapto. Oh my god, I completely forgot about that. You can just stand in Hermione's like water thing. Wow, this should be actually very quick, I just realized then. Second task would be awful, it's like so much HP4. The steam from the CO would also be an interesting workaround, because technically I guess that is water, yeah. Sorry, I, let's not talk about it exactly. Your favorite game? HP1 might honestly be the one we play the most in this, Bianca, I feel like. <laughs> I don't even know at this point. Like, most games should be really quickly, so I'm glad to hear that, your favorite thing. Also, yeah, Hermione's water thing... <laughs> Like, of course people have to take that out of context, why am I not surprised? Not only that, doesn't it rain so there are puddles in the first level? That was a shaky 
I don't know. I don't remember. It could be. I guess we'll just play through the game and see what we can find. Incendio in HP... Oh, in HP 1. Uh, yeah, you'll see. I have a very good plan for HP 1. It should be roughly 15-20 minutes. 3 is your favorite for PC, 3 is your 3 GBA is your favorite period. Honestly, I fully get that. HP 3 was never a book I was super into either, but I think in terms of video games, they're all good. Doesn't matter what console, they're actually all good, so I fully get that. Same thought, honestly. I love 3 PC, 3 GBA is super goaded, 3 Xbox is fun. They've done a good job that year with uh, Harry Potter video games. Actually, we have to play HP 6 a good bit today, I just realized. Probably like an hour or so, but I guess we'll see. Again, I don't want to take anything ahead or away. Because I guess it's more fun if it's in suspense. Um, because I do think I have thought of the best route again together with Sonya. Um, on how to touch water as quick as we can. HP3 is the best book, I won't take that slander. What does stay hydrated mean? Uh, basically, we play all eight games until we um, touch water. Don't you touch it super quick in HP6? I hope, I mean, that would be sick if you can somehow touch it at the barrel. I wasn't sure. I, I didn't think so. Also, no, HP3 is all good. I, know, I like the meme with the solid ice, but HP3 is also going to be quick. If, if that's possible, then this is going to be like actually a lot quicker than I thought. That would be great. I'll definitely try at the barrel. The less I have to play HP6, the better. Since I'm ever approaching old age with my subs. Happy 27. GLTV2. Old age with your subs. I mean, to be honest, absolutely true. That is a big number, 27. Thank you so much, Otter, for keeping that up for that freaking long. Uh, what water's early in 7.2? I'm gonna say that much. It's gonna be like about 10 15 minutes in, but I don't want to spoil too much. Like, I do think it's the most fun if people think about it themselves until we get to the game. So I, I don't want to get stuff too far ahead. We don't count rain. That's the one thing that Dennis has excluded from touching water. Of the first four, HP1 is definitely the longest. Yeah, probably, if you guys are correct about HP4. You throw cauldrons and water in HP6. Yeah, I just don't know if you can touch that body of water. I guess we'll see. I know a spot in HP6 where you definitely can, but... I'm not sure about the beginning. We'll try our hardest. We'll see. Uh, we had a Malfoy percent meme run. I do believe so, Sajuk. Yeah. Did we? We had Peeves and Hagrid and stuff. I think if you, you know, I'm pretty sure I remember making the thumbnail for that. Um, if you look it up on YouTube, you're probably gonna find it. Oh no, we did actually. That Supremo mentions HP4. Um, we did. There's a card. A card you can buy that has Tom Felton Smellfoy on it. You know, the cards in HP4 that have the movie snapshots. Also... Water! That was easy. Fuck us. And, of course, gotta stay hydrated. Think you can find a pawn when you first control Harry, but you cannot. But I don't know if you can touch it. Yeah, that's what I'm not sure about either with HP6. We'll see. But now we have HP2 for not a very long time, but that's okay. Oh my god, why is this so loud? Is that just me? HP5 is gonna be fun. Can only recommend people to stay. We found a very nice workaround that... Wait, there's water here! Lol. I wanted to go to the bean bonus room, but I guess... I guess hydrated twice. I completely forgot about that one as well. You told me about that fun twice. I guess I somehow missed that in chat twice. Uh, but yeah, there we go. That was a quick HP2. I have to admit, I, I didn't expect it to be that early, but oh well. Fountain is a fountain. So far, we're two and two with fountains. That seems to be the easiest way to get wet in Harry Potter. The easiest way to stay hydrated. Also, um, I'm actually out of liquid, which is a bit of a problem. I guess why HP4 is starting up, I can get some water, so I can stay hydrated during this run, of course. But now we have to suffer through the train anyways. Bounds as well, the non-prefect non pupil shower. Yeah, they never mentioned, like, proper bathrooms. Thank you so much. And no, it was not the shower water that I got, but the uh, actual water. Also, imagine having, like, this prepared so you're on the correct resolution. God damn it. 
the level up from touching grass. I think this one is actually surprisingly gonna be quicker. Like, imagine that it's quicker to touch water than just going onto grass, but I guess there isn't that much grass in HP games. You can't leave carpet? No. We have to probably play through carpet, is my guess as well. The Alien movie, the new one. Has anyone seen it yet? Without spoilers, obviously, please, but curious if people like it. Okay, cool. Now we've all under now we're all understanding the run though, you know? It won't have Ripley. I mean, yeah. She's she do be a bit old at this point. <laughs> so I guess for like the OG purist fans, it's probably not really anything anyways. Um all three of us. There's a fountain in the card courtyard. Oh, Akko is getting I mean, not close. That's basically the one I want to use. I believe that's the quickest. I can't think of any water in the train or in Carpa. Uh, no, you can spoil the fact that you've seen it. Just not the movie. That was my point. You know, f forget, forget I asked, actually. Yeah, that's that's the plan, I think. Dang, people know HP3, let's go. People do know their HP3, but that's what we're trying. Sadly, we can't go into the courtyard after Carpa, unfortunately. At least, I don't think there's a known way to do that. Uh, rain does not count. Rain is the one thing that's been accepted. Uh, accepted? Exempted? Is that a word? Excluded, that's what I'm looking for. I mean, technically, it's, you know, you are touching water, but... We'll do it as a body of water, I guess. Probably makes more fun. Nothing except Ron's tears of fear seeing the Dementor. I mean, yeah, we could maybe count those, I guess. <laughs> Stinging of the Karn too, but forgot you go straight to Carpa. Yeah, sadly, I still think it's the quickest. I don't think there's anything else you can do. Um, at least, not that I can think of. There's no water in Carpa, right? It's only Void, I think. Uh, HP 1 was the fountain and flying lesson, and HP 2 there is a fountain, like, literally five seconds in the game. <laughs> like, in the Willow there's one that you can cast Flapando on, and you get two beans. I forgot how much water there is in Willow, to be honest. I was so not expecting Willow. There's even water at the end, with the armor stands. Even, even at the end of Willow there's, a, like, two pools of it. I guess they really wanted to show off what Unreal Engine 1 is capable of. Yeah, it even has three. It's, I, I completely forgot about that. I was so ready to go to the beam bonus room. It's before the watered down version of a better game. Yeah, we should just instantly go to the next, honestly. That should count, right? There would also be the rain again. Rain, rain. I should have probably put that in the rules as well, but... Yeah, we, do, we don't count rain. Um, but I don't think there's any other case where it matters. But yeah, for HP2, we didn't want to count it. Not that it mattered much. How quick can you get outside? I think, sadly, not before Carper. I wish there would be a way, but we have to play through Carper from what I... I mean, there's there's no way to leave the challenge, but that is exactly the one I, I want to go to. <laughs> you know, yeah, the human body is 70% water, that's actually true. So I guess technically Harry's skin is touching water. I don't know, Harry's everything is touching water, I guess. Oh, Sprinklers and Incendio is cool as well, to be honest. I was also thinking about this one cave, uh, but I don't think you can you can touch the water. The one cave before Hagrid, there's, there's water dripping from the ceiling, I believe, if I recall correct. But that would have been after Incendio. That would have been cool with the Sprinklers. I like the idea of that. I don't think... I mean, there's like water at the snails as well, but I don't think you can touch it on the way to Incendio. But yeah, we got it quickly, so whatever. Oh, there's also in Wingardium, there's a big one. Um, you know where the card is, where it falls down, there's like a giant pool of water as well. Then you have water and Legacy, yeah, yeah. I have to say though, HP1 water actually looked goaded. Legacy water is obviously a step off, step up, but HP1 water is so, so nice. HP2, in my opinion, was a step back, and then HP3 as well. I don't know why, but they actually had, like, such nice custom textures for it and all that. Was that water or fog? I mean, I guess fog is technically water, right? But I wouldn't count this. I don't know, we can we can argue about this, I guess. Also, yeah, 21 minutes and we're in HP3 is probably the quickest Octo so far. I mean, there's nothing here. Fuck is rainwater. I mean, you know, it's technically it is water, but... HP1 is reverse flowing water, though, that's true. But still, the textures itself look great. 
Yeah, I, I wouldn't necessarily count this. I don't think this should count as water. You can jump Even if it would be like fog, it's like it's like some magical. I'd like this. No, no, I'm sorry. I wish, but no, that's that's not water. I think that's dumb. <laughs> like again, I'm I'm open to discuss that, but that smoke. Yeah, it could even be smoke. That's also true. I don't think that should count. At least we get to play good games for longer, so... <laughs> the void, not water, yeah. I, I agree with that. It's definitely not supposed to be, like, a lake. Only pure water in a liquid state counts. Honestly... I mean, pure water, people are gonna be making jokes like, Oh, but surely there's some dirt in that fountain. <laughs> but, like, yeah, no. I know what you mean. That's basically, I think, what we should go for. Those kind of runs always have room for interpretation, but yeah. It's solid ice. I would say, like, the ice probably shouldn't count, but you can jump onto some of them while it's still water, so it would work. I think I think it's pretty self-explanatory. I think so far we're doing quite well with what we count and what we don't count. Oh god, that's not gonna make it. I couldn't move my mouse, I'm a Gramch. Should have had 200 milliliters of water, is that how it works? One hydrating zip is 100 milliliters? <laughs> well, I'm sure I did. I have no idea how many milliliters my glass can hold, but surely. Harry's socks have to be wet, that's a fair rule as well, I like that. But that wouldn't apply for HP1 because, I mean, I guess I flew through it, they probably would have gotten wet. Wait, why am I drinking? I'm not allowed to. Only staying hydrated when Harry stays hydrated. Yeah, Dennis talked about it early. I guess touch fire percent would technically be possible. But yeah, I, I like that. I like the I like the idea of uh, saying his socks have to oh, be wet. This is really bad. Oh my lord. Okay, I have no idea how we made that, but I'll take it. <laughs> that was ridiculously terrible, but actually didn't lose any time, so that's cool. Uh, one liter for every game, yeah. Eight liters, I'm pretty sure would get you water poisoning. I feel like that probably kills you. Uh, oh yeah, true, there is fire in HP6 even in that fight, I think. You're right. Isn't water, isn't ice always solid? Yep. That's why that voice line is such a meme, because Flitwick is like so proud of his solid ice. Or Harry is proud of his solid ice, rather. Forgetting that, like, that's kind of just how ice works, you know. I'm dumb. Also fair, forgetful. That does not, indeed, not sound very pleasant. Uh, blindfolded percent when I have actually done a blindfolded HP3. And it's a good demonstration why blindfolded HP speedrunning is pretty horrible. It's on YouTube somewhere. If you look for, like, blind on my channel, I'm sure you find it, Walker. Uh, it's, it's definitely an experience. <laughs> um... Takes much more water than that and at a way faster rate, I guess. Oh god! So you're saying 8 liters is not enough? I have no idea how I saved that, but let's go. Wizards can surely create soft ice too. Isn't soft ice a thing? We have that word. We have soft ice for like a sort of ice cream, but it's uh... I don't know how to explain it. It's the one that comes out of a tap, sort of. And it's like very, well, soft. That's, that's where the name comes from in German. It's very soft and very ice, exactly. Also, God, wait, hello? Speedrunning at 90, I'll still be doing bingo. Oh yeah, the McDonald's eyes, that's a, that's a good way to explain it, exactly. My 90-year-old speedrunning is definitely gonna be only bingo. It's actually not that bad, because a lot of games are relatively quick, I believe, so we're not actually that mental for doing it. I'm not sh fully sure how long it takes, I was expecting like one to... Uh, two to three hours. I guess I can play this. Can I play this with keyboard? If it's as quick as people say it is, I guess I can. I guess I'll be Hermione. I hope there really is stuff in here. Oh god, I haven't played this with keyboard for so long. Also true, this would be fire already, yeah. People say there's puddles here? I'm not seeing puddles. I, wish, I mean, not quite rough though, I guess, would work though. Yeah, so there definitely aren't any, like, puddles. Also, no, I'm a miney, I just misinput it. Oh god, I have to jinx with X, that's so cursed. We're expanding on the touch grass idea, you know? It's actually not, it's actually probably quicker, I would assume. Water in HP1 was the fountain in flying class, that's where we got it. The controls are cursed, yeah, they're horrible. 
They're really, really horrible. Like, who controls their game with freaking Y, X, and C? Y? <laughs> yeah, we have to touch water as quick as we can, exactly. Uh, we'll say Harry. I mean, there's no water in this anyways. There's water under, under the bridge, but I don't think you can touch it. But yeah, the rules, usually it's with Harry. With the touch grass, we've done the same, exactly. Which I think Savi asked about it. We have done touch grass. Rene had, uh, came up with that back in the days. And I did a run as well. It is on YouTube, so I can recommend. How do you even do this with keyboard? Can you even do this with keyboard? This is really close to touching water, by the way. Like, would we count this? Are there videos of me I wouldn't recommend? Oh yeah, plenty. Especially the old ones. Like, would no, I don't think I'm here. We don't have Aqua Raptor quite yet, no. I guess I'll have to go through here. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, as a child I hated those controls as well. I didn't have a freaking controller either. It was the worst, Paco. And no, we haven't. We haven't done fire or air yet. Even though air would just be the quick change. <laughs> Octo Factor. But yeah, I guess out of all the elements, this is the second one we do. After grass. I don't think this is sub one, no. I think HP6 is gonna be too long because of course it is. It's freaking HP6. It's always long. It was really close. So close to water, but yet so far away because they build invisible walls because of course they did. The aqua factor. Okay, from now on I should only play Harry. A lot of people are here to watch me watch touch water. <laughs> They'll help you cast more powerful Staying spell. hydrated is important, of course. You know, that's, that's what this run teaches us. Uh, no. Not with every spell. We've done a full series where we switched games after casting one spell. But we've never done that. I feel like that would actually be quite a long run, but I could I could look into uh, how much it would take. Wizard. Whoops. You got it. You got it. Thanks, Moody. Ron asking like he didn't go to a magical school for two years. I mean, he's just a bit slow, you know. <laughs> His brain is not very good at computing instructions. We have to touch water, stay hydrated. Harry's gonna be very hydrated after that, that one, after this, that one, I can tell you. It's gonna be a lot of water in his mouth. Okay, so I need to bait the AI to start with fire, right? Uh. Oh, Ron, do that again, please. Ah, there we go. Got splashed by Hermione's water, and yes, I did say that before, so I'm immune to getting quoted. Cool! Again, I don't think Harry's gonna be thirsty anymore after that. And the paddles during that lay. Oh no, that's when it was super hot. That's the plot line, even. It's like super hot in the UK, so they're all sweating in the movie and stuff, so I really don't think there's any water. Not even with the Dementors. But uh, it won't be long. V8, V8 knows. I saw him post about it earlier. I didn't want to say anything about it because it was right, but no spoilers, of course. There is some water that you can reach relatively well. Um, also, of course, stay hydrated. I don't remember if I did. Oh, one and two both have fountains. Three as well. Those, the first three were literally just fountains, no? In uh, Flying Class, Willow, and the Courtyard of HP3. Oh, no, 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 it's not a normal lock defect. Those are indeed pretty long, that's true. I would have started that one a bit late, Shady, I see. I see where the confusion is coming from. Um, oh, who? Can you stand in the prefix bathtub? No. Uh, rain doesn't count. Rain doesn't count. You guys were absolutely right. But rain doesn't count. Dennis, Dennis said it doesn't count. The person requesting it. Which I guess makes sense, but you're a mark as well. I actually kind of forgot there was actual rain in there, I have to admit. If I still do ra this rain, if I still do it, this rain will count. I mean, that's fair, Renee. I like the other option more, though. I think it's cooler, but we'll see. So I'm actually quite happy that rain doesn't count. Go stand outside in a rainstorm and don't tell me you aren't wet. I mean, I don't disagree with it. Oh, so yeah, thanks for pointing it out, both you and Zorni did, I think, with the rain. I appreciate that. I probably would have missed it, to be honest. There was a new Mafia game announced? No Bioshock 4, but a new Mafia game? That's exciting. I hope, I hope it's good, because the last one was kind of like meh, wasn't it? Can't think of a single argument why rain isn't water. True. 
it doesn't hydrate. I guess that's true. What touch water it makes more sense, I guess. But since Harry doesn't like he couldn't I mean you could drink from it as well. Whatever. Let's just accept that we don't count rain. <laughs> Whatever. Uh also the boulder of the Phoenix lol. <laughs> touch rock. That's the next meme run. The next element. Why am I playing it in English? Because it's a meme run and I miss the English dub, I have to admit. Uh Usually during meme runs I've started to just play all the games in English just for some nostalgia basically. Also I have absolutely no idea wizard it could be. It's, ni it's nice though Supreme, it's nice people are hyped about being hydrated, you know, it's important. So that would be interesting as well, so it would, it would just be run percent though I think. I think it would be run percent. Mafia the Old Country, it's a prequel to the first one. Oh, oh that's cool. If it's actually in uh, in Italy, that's exciting. That, that's a nice setting, but I mean, I don't really trust modern games anymore to be good, but I like the setting. So Gamescom did get people hyped. Nice. Yeah, it would be an alternative run percent, basically. Oh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Yeah, true, they're making that. And the first one was actually freaking amazing. So glad you're getting a new PC. Yeah, you can f finally play all of those amazing games. Stay Fanta Drated I like as well. So, I mean, we do have Fanta in the fridge, but, you know, this run is supposed to be a healthy run, right? So we, we keep, we stick with water. Oh, a new Dragon Ball game. Is it like a fighting game? Fourth Borderlands. Oh god, after the disastrous, like, movie adaptation? <laughs> is, that a, is that really a good idea? Oh, I see puddles being mentioned a lot. I don't know what you guys are talking about. What are what are puddles? I don't know what that word means. Hey, maybe, maybe it is a puddle, potentially. Oh, did they talk about uh, the Quidditch game as well? I'm kind of curious. I think so too, considering I don't have a PB and stay hydrated percent, I think we got this. Like there are certain PBs even someone like me can't throw, so... <laughs> I believe in this. Oh my god, puddles come from rain, so surely it doesn't count. Actually, you could argue, since they're inside in this game, they don't. I don't know what they come from, though, but yeah, that was the plan. People, people, you are smart. There's puddles in the entrance hall. You use a mop to mop them up, so it has to be... It, it has to be water, and you can stand in it. And I guess, like, why are they there? We don't really want to know. Yeah, I hope it's not JP's option. It, it certainly didn't rain in, so... Come from burst pipes. Isn't there like actually, um, doesn't lakes come from rain too? I mean, that's fair. Technically, doesn't all water come from rain? Peeves. Yeah, I was also thinking, Peeves, isn't there like a book scene where Peeves is throwing water at people? Isn't that actually a thing? Or am I making that up? I'm not sure if that's HP5, but it could be. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure that scene exists, so, you know, it's it's definitely fine. Myrtle dripping water all over the place. Could be, I guess. Yeah, it's a bit weird. I've never questioned those puddles, but... In three or four. I guess it was four then, yeah. Two people say it before. I see. Love the slap scene. We have an emote of it. It's a great emote. Fully agreed. A ghost made out of water? I don't think. I don't think they're made out of anything, right? A leaky AC. It's the AC for the Great Hall. That's, that's probably what it is. Drips into the entrance hall. What's my plan besides puddles? Uh, puddles. <laughs> that, that was always the plan. Apart from that, you could have played until the swamps in the end. But that would have been like an hour 45, roughly. They're made of ectoplasm. Hmm. Is ectoplasm made out of water? Not sure. They make you cold when walking through them, so we must be made of something. It's a footprint of a soul. Yeah, they're made of soul, exactly. Uh, but yeah, those are puddles. They don't look like it, but those are definitely water puddles, because you do use this to, to mop them up. There's a mop in here. So, wait, is that a mop or is that is that dust? Or is the mop in Viaduct Entrance? I wasn't sure, because there's something in Viaduct Entrance as well. Also, really? I kind of want to try that now, Mark. We, we give it some extra minutes. Not deep enough to get his socks wet. Nah, nah, it should be okay. Like, this is this is definitely fine. We're not playing in French, so I'm no expert anymore. So I have no idea that's how it works. Wait, you can even get it through the door? Yeah, that's definitely a mop. See? See, look, look how it's splashing. That is... Burn cast, yeah. Field HP3, man. That is certainly water. 
Yeah, this run is definitely, it's, uh, it's a bit of a quick one. Also, fuck, I'm on Spanish. Oh, well, whatever. <laughs> I really, really, really hope you can touch the water in uh, the barrel. Otherwise, this run might start to not be at all quick anymore. But yeah, we're on this PC now with the new setting, which apparently makes it crash-free for most people. We'll see. I'm knowing my luck, probably still gonna crash. <laughs> But yeah, I, I'm I'm through half the water here, so we're definitely staying hydrated during this. I like that I, I read that, by the way, JP. Next time we do this run, which I'm sure we do it plenty of times, staying hydrated is fun. I won't have to explain to people uh, <laughs> that it's water in the in the entrance all of HP five. Big time save potential in that game. Uh, I like how they made this the entire movie. Yeah, it's the easiest way to uh, to watch it illegally. Just play the game. It's basically like watching the movie. Don't even have to pay for it. <laughs> We're basically doing a watch party. Splash the water on yourself with the cauldron. That would be sick if that works. I don't think they have the physics of that, right? Maybe with the broomstick. That's the one thing I can think of. There's small puddles in the cave passage to Quidditch. Are there? I would love to, because the less we have to play HP6, the better, but I don't remember those. I have to say, this game has never been this sharp, because playing it through Parsig, I think it gets, like, rendered down a bit. Can I touch this? Oh, I can't. Wait, there's water here. No, why is he not touching? It's so close. <laughs> no, Harry. There's so much water here. Oh, HP6 being HP6 again, I can't. No reflection. Imagine the engine actually supporting that. Come on, touch, touch, touch! No, that was the grass. Yeah, we'll probably be in HP6 hell for like an hour or so. Even here there's rain if you look at the- <gasps> Wait, I touched, I touched, I touched, right? I touched the ground, it, it must have been water, I was right above water. We, we need a- we need a referee. We need it. We need a. We need a video check. I'm pretty sure I touched. Do I go back in the vault? No splash. Yeah, because this fucking engine sucks. It's not like that's the freaking. That's what counts. Yeah, I was also thinking burrow duel, but I, I'm, I touched the floor, right? We dipped our feet in. It's not my fault. The physics of this game don't work. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm not sure what to do now, but I'm pretty sure we touched the floor. Like, he bounced off the floor and it was right above the, the body of water. I think it's it counts as well. Sadly, the one who requested it, sadly, then has looked away, <laughs> which is unfortunate. Oh, so yeah, touching grass is a lot easier here. Can we try to rewatch? Yes, please. Thank you. Like, I am very certain I touched the water there. Again, no splash, because, like, it's it's a bad game, but... There, again! See? That one that one is an edge case, but I did it again. Pretty sure in the same spot, even. That ha that has to count. Oh, again. We touched the sea, or the lake. Again, doesn't have any physics, but that's not my fault. I'm still gonna wait for Dennis's official um, count, so we can also listen to Glu Glu Tiquero. Sadly, not to see Kasi Kasi, but we need a slow-mo clip. <laughs> Wait, actually, before I go there... Can you go here, you bounce off the ground? Yeah, but the ground happened to be water! Also here, by the way. I'm standing... I'm sort of standing in water as well. See? If that doesn't count, I don't know what does. Like, his foot is literally in there. That's mud. Oh, fuck off, I count this. <laughs> I don't even care. One of them definitely counts. I don't just leave me alone with that. <laughs> that is definitely okay. <laughs> uh, okay, seven point one. <laughs> Thanks, Dennis. No, I, I think I, I genuinely think one of those two has to count. I think his feet are wet. Also, we have to stay hydrated, of course. I we go back. We we do once we're done with this entire run. I'll go back in my editing software and show you all when I touch water. You'll see. I used to look after you before you started doing invalid runs. Hey, leave me alone. This is okay. I'll I'll show you all, okay? It's like another 15, 20 minutes until we're done, but I'll go, I'll give you the video proof. I don't care. But 
What you bumped into during flying was a wooden pier. Oh. But I bumped into two things at the end as well. Trusted you for three years, but now, hey, hey, hold, hold off your judgment until we look at the video uh, proof, okay? How can we tell it's water without water, physi water physics and not some <laughs> Willy Coyote painted cliff face or something? Yeah, maybe since the Weasleys are too poor for actual lakes, so they just painted them onto the grass. That seems about right. Got hit by a smooth criminal, yeah. You're watching a very dangerous streamer. After that, I think you know for sure. We don't care about the rules here. It's like, fuck the rules all the way, clearly. You believe me? Well, thank you. At least that's one person. The one person that didn't see it believes. Probably not a good sign for me, but... Oh, see, yeah, we, we, have the, we have the best part. We have to keep going, Hagrid. <laughs> one of the saddest deaths. Does it even happen in this game? I just realized. I don't think so, right? In the hearts of the gamers, Hedwig, you know, is always alive. Also, yeah, we're kind of almost in the clouds. Are we flying through them? Sort of. I think... Hmm, we're not we're not really flying through it. Technically, I guess this is water. I mean, the clouds kind of disappear before they touch Harry, because this game's rendering is awful, but... Th there's a very obvious one later on. But before that, you won't get us. We have to get out of here. Her death is a necessary price to get rid of Colin. I see it's a trade-off. What do you mean rain doesn't come but clowns do? Yeah, that's a fair point. That's a fair point. You guys have a fair point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I see. There's there's an overwhelming opinion in chat that clouds also don't count. It's okay. I, I accept it. That is a fair point. Hedrick flew away to a farm. Yeah, she's in a better place now. But at least we can enjoy Hagrid's amazing ride through this tunnel. And I always have fun pointing out everything that's, like, wrong with it. Always miss Death Eater 9. Yeah, the one Harry stupefied. When I thought about it this morning, I literally thought this is gonna be, like, four hours or something. Four to five. But then, like, we found more and more, like, you know, uh, nice ways to, to step into water quickly. So, yeah. Uh, I guess here we are now. It's actually shorter than we thought. If ice doesn't count, then neither should clouds. Also, that's a fair point, yeah. I see, I see. I mean, yeah, we don't count the clouds. If clouds are created, then water vapor turns into liquid water droplets, yeah. Yeah, true. Technically, it shouldn't count, I agree. Keep going, Hagrid. Oh. Best motivational speaker, yeah. I think it's only so Hagrid doesn't fall asleep. He doesn't look very good on the spike there. <laughs> he looks like he's about to pass out. Hey, I'm not I'm not cheesing it that much, Devin. All of them made a lot of sense, honestly, all of our waters. I mean the HP one and HP6 one I guess you can argue with, but I'll I'll give you guys the video proof, don't don't you worry. We have to get out of here. German education. <laughs> I learned about the water cycle as well, okay? Which is how I know that clouds are indeed made out of water, technically, but... Yeah, we, we don't count them. You know, I've agreed to it already. You don't have to keep on kicking a man who's on the floor, you know? I've admitted defeat on those. But I have to say, I didn't expect to be in HP 7.1 after an hour only. Can I drink salt water? I mean... Technically, this counts as, counts as hydration, right? Coffee, I guess. I mean, I don't know if it counts as hydrating because water kind of drains the uh, salt, kind of drains the water away again. But still, <laughs> nice airship. Also, wait for it. That is that even has splash effects. If that's not water, then I don't know what is. And we're already on to 7.2, less than one hour. Now we have to watch a four-minute cutscene. <laughs> Yay! Oh, there's a lot of water here, by the way. I wouldn't mind uh, touching that, but it is what it is. Played the seventh game like once in my lifetime. Yeah, they're not necessarily the most popular ones. Uh, I don't play them all, so, all, all super often on my channel either, to be honest. Oh, is he stepping in a puddle here, maybe? 
Actually, I'm gonna pay very close attention. Gringotts has a few puddles, really? Oh, there is the waterfall! I forgot about that. I was thinking about the dragon uh, after, like, the bank, but... I forgot about the waterfall. I guess that's definitely water. Wet sand is still sand, not water. Yeah, but if there would have been a puddle, you know... It's magical water, so it isn't real water. I mean, isn't it just real water that's magically, like, enchanted? Yeah, so I guess we don't even have to play this game. That's my favorite kind of 7.2. <laughs> when I don't actually have to play it, it's perfect. Oh yeah, it's in the video game, that's true. So I guess it's not real water. I have to pour water into my PC. Also, I didn't hydrate after 7.1. Hmm. Uh, the Adibus fight, yeah, in German. That is... Oh, but we don't see Harry touching it, do we? Ooh. It's like a weird first-person BS, you know? Uh, it will definitely be on YouTube. Probably won't even take super long to put it on there, because I really like the concept, and it's like, you know, relatively sh short. This is tough, because, like... It would be a fitting ending to the run, that is true. I mean, it's definitely Harry who touched it, right? The whole screen got wet? Yeah, that's not wrong. I'll wait for Dennis to see if he counts it, but I, I, I mean... I think it should. I don't think you can. I'm thinking about it as well, the waterfall, but... The most touching, water touching there's been, I mean, you guys are kind of not wrong. Oh, no, actually you can. I mean, I'm definitely getting water, and it's not rain, by the way, before someone starts with that. Yeah, this should this this is pretty wet to me as well, honestly. I I think I think we're properly wet. Yeah, it was a cool luck effect. I approve of it as well. It was actually so much shorter than I thought it would be, but yeah, this this should be okay. Thanks for the GGs. That was that was really good. I enjoyed that a ton. Uh, we need to do the video proof though. The water mist should count too. Yeah, also true. Like, there's definitely water around, you know. GG's pro probably wet percent is finished. Yeah, I was actually thinking like four or five, maybe even six hours, but there's like so much early water in this game. Actually kind of cool. You can look at the entire level. That's actually kind of cool. I've never noticed that. Even this part is like the level, is it? No, I don't think it is. Okay, look at the end. Look at me touching. See? Look. See? You saw that? Like, what am I touching here if not water? Here. He bobs up from there. That, I, if that's not water, I don't know what is. I mean, I'm sorry, chat, but look. This this is the body of water, and I'm nowhere near the, the weird grass, and he, he gets bobbed up. If you ask me, that's... It's not the weed. It's so far away. Not hitting grass, no, it's wrong. <laughs> it's so far away, the weed. It's there. I'm, it's, I'm not even close. Like, this is when he starts bobbing up. There's nothing there. This is definitely touching water. You guys just don't have eyes.